Bitcoin is breaking out above 12k level. Is the massive bull run in Bitcoin starting now? Welcome back guys, it's Crypto Rocco from Rockstar Trading Channel. In today's video guys, I'll be sharing with you my thoughts on Bitcoin. I'll be sharing with you where I'm buying, where I'm selling. I won't just be saying this, I would have bought it there. Like after the fact, I'll be showing exactly during time where I was buying, where I was selling on the live streams, where, where, where my stop losses were, where my entries were. I'll share with you exactly how I'm trading. I know loads of people say Bitcoin going up, Bitcoin going down i'll be sharing with you what i need what i will do if bitcoin breaks up because it's not no point making predictions like hundreds of other youtubers i actually trade and make money so make sure you watch the video till the end uh, so i'll go into detail on exactly how i'm trading bitcoin but i'll also share with you guys some long-term stuff so bitcoin guys we've not seen bitcoin close above this weekly level since back in early 2018 2017 when we've uh, went above that we've not had a weekly close above you know 12k uh where is that level we've not had a a weekly close above 12k which is very very key last time we had a weekly close back when was there so if we get a weekly close and you know it pulls back on the hourly four hourly the trading strategies i talk about for years and uh, make sure you check it out you know if bitcoin breaks out this could be an opportunity of a lifetime i'm not you don't make as much money during this move you make money when things going up there that's when you you, you make the life-changing uh, worth of money so if bitcoin does break out we're still at resistance we're not out of the woodwork but if bitcoin does break out you need to make sure you're prepared prepared for that bull move you make sure you have a strategy whether you learn hours where i do live streams every day uh, three to four times a day. I actually did a live stream when Bitcoin was breaking out. Uh, when I'm posting every day, other people are posting. Uh, make sure you educate yourself. So that's the key thing I'm looking out for. The weekly close above this 12k level, and then if we pull back and hold, then we can start talking about the crazy price predictions. Uh, make sure you watch the video till the end. We can talk about you know is this something like you know the pullback that we saw back in 2014? Then we had that huge breakout. You know five six thousand percent move. I'm not even going to talk about a uh, five six thousand percent move. That's you know that will take us to something crazy but i mean i, I hodl bitcoin i'll show I'll, I'll show you exactly where i've sold bitcoin because you know bitcoin has hit resistance and i've actually sold bitcoin i'll i'll share with you during the live stream exactly how i was selling bitcoin where i bought where i sold but the important thing is, God, I can even take a screenshot. I'll take a screenshot and show that to you. Uh, uh, but the important thing is, guys, if Bitcoin continues higher, I hodl Bitcoin. Bitcoin is one of the only things I hodl. And if Bitcoin gets to some, I won't sell that unless Bitcoin goes to something like 100K or something crazy. I won't sell that. So, again, I've got to share with you my trading analysis and, and also keep the long time frame uh, checking analysis. And especially with, you know, potential dollar inflation and crazy dollar printing. And if the stock market goes up. And if Bitcoin breaks out, we can see some crazy numbers. No one would have believed you, you know, if, say, if, you, if, they, if they told you Bitcoin was going to be at 10, 20K. I got in Bitcoin in early 2017 and I uh, didn't think that it was going to be like this. This was uh, life changing. So if we see something like that, uh, hopefully uh, people in my group, you know, they've you know held Bitcoin to the bear markets. I hope they uh, get that big bill move. That would be amazing to see. So without further ado, let's get into the video. It's been a, a long introduction, but I'm really excited uh, to see this move happen. This was a really a nicely traded move. So let's get into the video now. So Bitcoin, guys, uh, from a higher time frame, Bitcoin broke above that 10.6k level. That was a huge breakout. I was bearish here when it came into here. I took a short position. I shared that with you when I took that. When Bitcoin came down, I sh sh closed half. When it couldn't get back above, I closed that position. And then, guys, when Bitcoin broke out of there, I'll share with you going to the hourly and four hourly. There was a, f a nice hourly setup. And if you watch my previous video, I talked about my best coin in this altcoin season is bitcoin now how do you recommend you go watch that video that was yesterday as well so i'm not saying it's in my group i'll share it in my youtube as well make sure you smash that like button subscribe to my channel and turn on the notification button all my subscribers means a lot to me so i'll carry on providing content i'll share with you exactly what i'm doing on youtube which coins i'm looking to buy what levels in the group i'll share with the exact strategy what stop losses entries and everything so that's what i'm looking out for bitcoin so when bitcoin guys uh, broke out above here this is where i went long with bitcoin i sold half here i sold another half here so i was 25 uh, percent in and then rest of it guys this was my huge resistance i actually did this live i'll uh, play i can play a bit of that i'll mute it uh, but this is the live stream that i did three to four hours ago i do you know live streams like this 
Uh, usually when things are breaking now I actually shared people where I actually sold and I actually uh, sell Bitcoin around this level I didn't think Bitcoin was gonna uh, break out of that level and you can see the entries and exits as well this is uh, where I sold uh, most of my Bitcoin and now I'm in a position with 10% in from there where I got and I'm waiting so if Bitcoin now gives a four hour pullback an hourly pullback I'm gonna look to buy if you don't own any Bitcoin I wouldn't say buy it all now because this is a huge move up I don't like buying after huge moves up look Look for a pullback look for a breakout look for an indicator whatever strategy you use look to get in and um, again I, I shared the entries I'll share with you what I posted yesterday I said you know people that are not in you know people are shy as well the if you're new to trading you're scared to get into positions and I said if you haven't bought look to buy pullbacks and if you, you could be buying the top but we don't know as traders I didn't know if this was the top I just took a position because I know this is a high probability trade I had my stop loss I said you can look to buy now with a stop loss below these levels Bitcoin didn't break below these levels and it carried on higher so now my thoughts are i'll be looking to buy pullbacks into bitcoin and i think the next targets would be 13k 14k level if we break out of that i mean that's when we can start talking about moon targets we've not got many resistances unless un, until potentially you know the 16k 20k level uh, but that's the next key zone that i am looking at where i'll look to if, if a bitcoin pulls back gives me a setup i'll look to take a trade towards there and then if it breaks out then we can talk about the moon targets the bearish setup i mean i'm not gonna even think about a bearish setup you know if people there was looking for uh, short setups i know this this was definitely a short squeeze as well people are looking to go short around these levels and i at least wait for a structure you know i need to see something like this you know it tries to break up it can't then it breaks below and then breaks resistance this is where i look to sell break support this is where i look to sell otherwise i'm going to wait i need a trend change before i go short at least on the shorter time frames as well if that doesn't happen i'm gonna be bullish bias uh, on a higher time frame if you can't watch the daily time frame, if you can't watch the shorter time frame if we get a spike tomorrow like a big red candle tomorrow like we saw here or previous tops as you can see then i would start changing my bias a bit but i'm happy to risk that money you know i'll share uh, i'll tell you guys this as well this is where i went long in bitcoin if you guys watch my videos then uh, it was i took half off and I, I got stopped out and this was another loss i took long bitcoin here as well and this is where i sh went short and this is probably one of my best calls on youtube and again go watch the back uh, that call was right and don't just listen to me make sure i could be wrong the next four times i was right uh you know at this breakout i was wrong here because i went short here if you watch my previous video so you know make sure you have your own strategies just repeating your own strategy learning uh, how to trade it's not about you know one trade or two trades it's about long term people who want to be you know make money do trading for a job but they want to be they trade like they have to retire tomorrow they want to do trading full time for the rest of their lives but the way they trade the risk they take uh, the most important thing i can talk about is risk management and being in the market long term because if bitcoin does have that big breakout guys it will be life changing and uh, i hope you guys have a strategy because if bitcoin breaks out and uh, you don't sell take profits you don't want to be you know buying bitcoin at 10k and then uh, go to 20k and then dump back to your level so that's my thoughts on bitcoin i've shared exactly how i would be trading it now i want to just share some fun stuff with you so like the other youtubers i'll share with you some sort of crazy uh, price uh, predictions so the monthly time frame if you have a look uh, bitcoin you know this look this is looking like a consolidation that we have seen previously similar sort of consolidations back in 2014 it was a lot back different back then because there wasn't as much interest now there's a lot more interest market cap is a lot higher there's you know interest from wall street but i think if it breaks out i think fomo is going to get in people uh, your doctor your uh, taxi driver will be talking about bitcoin and we could be trending higher i mean i don't even well, i've made videos i might make another video about bitcoin cycle and some fibonacci price targets but i'm just going to look to trade and what i will do is what i like to see is staying above that red moving average this could be an educational bit uh, back then when bitcoin broke out uh, it held so you can see bitcoin broke out above a thousand dollar was a huge level back back then in 2017 level i got in around here i was what started watching charts here and you can see it broke out held that weekly moving average and this is what i want to see now if we see this now guys how i'm joke i joke that i'll sell my house and get into bitcoin but this is what i'd look for to get into bitcoin and as you can see this all run we pulled back to the weekly 20 moving average and held it and you know even if you bought this one this this is a valid entry this would have been a loss but 
you know this one one of these trades will uh, be life changing for you so that's what i'm looking at for bitcoin now is holding the weekly 20 moving average and pushing higher we want to see another push up and then pull back and we'll see consolidation i want to see more consolidation as well and i don't want to just see you know big spike up here and then down that won't be as good like it went parabolic there i want to see nice trending move like we've seen uh, here so we'll have to see if we get that uh, that's what i'm hoping for i mean i know a lot of people are hoping for that and and that's when altcoins are going to be amazing as well i know my channel is more altcoin based and um, you make uh, crazy amounts of money after the uh, bitcoin move and when bitcoin moves sideways and that's when altcoin pumps and that's exactly what we're going to be looking for if we do get that there are lots of news as well that's pushing Bitcoin higher. There's the PayPal Bitcoin news. There's also news about Fed accepting Bitcoin. Uh, that is a huge, huge news. I've talked about that before. I can, uh, I'll talk, make another video on fundamental. But there's news about you know Fed embracing digital currency, and you know if Fed, <laughs> if Fed's looking at digital currency, that's really bullish. And PayPal accepting Bitcoin as well. That's lots of bullish news. Everything's going great. Let's see what happens again. Uh, at the end of the video I'll share and everyone else will talk about the bullish scenarios at the end of the video I want to uh, end the video and make sure you're still risk managing taking profits you know I've shared with you how I'm trading it where I'll look to get in if Bitcoin starts you know getting back below 12k and you know trend changes and break support then I'll look differently so thank you very much for watching this video I hope you enjoyed it. if you have enjoyed it smash that like button subscribe to my channel comment below your Bitcoin price predictions and I'll see you guys soon with another great video thank you very much